Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Faces of Luxembourg. Today, I am going to take you on a beautiful walk. It is November, but check out this weather. The sun is out. It's a gorgeous day, so let's do this. We start here at the Glacis parking lot. So basically this is an enormous parking lot in the area of Limpertsburg. Check out the plane. And it's on this parking space that they usually organize a big amusement fair called the Schubefoa, which obviously was cancelled this year due to Covid. But it usually fills up this whole space. There are rides, there are stands, you can eat, have something to drink. It's really a fun two or three weeks, I think. But anyway, let's move on and head over to Kirschberg. We'll do this on foot because the view, as usual, is unreal. Let's do this. So fun fact, Luxembourg actually had a tramway up until the 70s, if I'm not mistaken. But now for the past few years, they've been working so hard to get the tram system back up and running. There is already a stretch that has been working and apparently the rest of the network should be running uh, in the next couple of months. From Glacis all the way up to Kirschberg where we're headed. Charlotte and I say this all the time but check it out because the view here insane check it out and the first place I want to show you is the funiculaire uh, that takes you from up here in Kirschberg down below to the Puffenthal area where you can catch your train. got the train tracks. This saves you actually quite a way to go, so you can get down to the train tracks pretty effortlessly. We don't need to take the train because we're continuing by foot, so let's go back up. And we made it back to the top. So here, right beside the funiculaire station, there is something super cool that you can actually find all around the city. These velo bikes. So basically these are rentable bikes that you can use to cruise all around the city. And all of this can be done with this here machine. So you just need to find a machine like this and everything can be done touch screen. So a very nice uh, alternative to taking your car, a velo bicycle, I approve. absolutely gorgeous Philharmonie and over here you've got the European Parliament Schumann building and over there the Hotel Melia
So behind me over here we have the Mudam, which is the modern art museum here in Kirchberg. Fun fact, this was designed by Chinese-American architect Liu Mingpei, sorry for butchering the pronunciation of the name, who also designed the Louvre Pyramid. As usual, Luxembourg only delivers when it comes to insane views, but this one is breathtaking. Check it out. The European Parliament. Where are you, Finland? Oh, there you are. In the back. Swami. So here I am in front of the Centre National Sportif et Culturel, also known as the Cock. The name is unfortunate for us English speakers. I do still find it funny after living here for 12 years, but hey ho. So you've got swimming pools, courts to play, different types of sports, there is a fitness center, restaurants, uh, even a hotel. Great place, the cock. No, it'll never stop being funny. And just behind the cock, we've got a really cool park. So let's check it out. And here we have one of the university campuses. It has its own tram stop. And another Velo bike station. Guys, we are approaching the public library. This building is very new but so, so cool. I mean, this looks, this, I think this is really the coolest library I've ever seen. Check it out. Bibliothèque Nationale. I think this building behind me is also very cool. I love the design. What is it, you may ask? Well, it's a bank. This area is pretty much a business district. You've got a lot of banks, a lot of companies. So a lot of people come here specifically to work. There is also a shopping center right around the corner, as well as the cinema. Let's get on the train. So behind me, we've got Lux Expo The Box, um, an exhibition center and also a concert hall. Came here two years ago to see Mike Shinoda perform live, one of the best concerts of my life. And we come back down and we're back here by the main JFK Avenue and just beside the Kinepolis. which is the main cinema complex of Luxembourg City. So I'm gonna head on back and head home. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have you subscribed yet? If not, you know what to do. And don't forget to click on that bell thingy to get notifications each time I upload a new video. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye.